so today we'll see how to use tensorflow without actually installing it in your system well uh, many of you might not be familiar with tensorflow well tensorflow is a python framework used to implement deep learning and machine learning and uh, many people uh, are cu currently learning and using tensorflow to become a uh, machine learning and deep learning experts but how do we install it well it's not that difficult but uh, tensorflow to be installed in your system is a very heavy library and very heavy framework um, in many cases uh, you have to uh, install and update your graphical drivers and tensorflow uses your cpu gpu and as well as tpu uh, which stands for tensorflow processing unit uh, and it's a uh, very heavy to use and it requires a lot of computational power uh, when using loads of data so it's uh, better to use in in the beginning it's better to use uh, tensorflow on internet using google collabs google collabs is an alternative to use tensorflow instead of installing it and it's very easy to use and uh, there won't be any system error or any update error uh, related to google collabs because the code you write in uh, google collabs the tensorflow code you write in google collabs is uh, processed in the backend so you don't have to install it uh, in a system and there won't be any errors now uh, let's see how it's done you open any web browser or chrome browser and type in collab hit enter and then uh, you'll see the collab.research.google.com and click click on it and then uh, you'll see the page where uh, i have already created a few notebooks but uh, i'll show you how to create a new notebook it's very easy just one click and uh, you have your work environment here uh, just in a moment well it's very easy to use and uh, you have the work environment here the work environment is uh, quite similar to uh, your jupyter notebook and you have you can add here uh, an empty line of code by using this plus code and uh, you can connect the uh, your notebook your environment to the backend first let us import tensorflow and then uh, hit control plus enter it's a shortcut to run the particular line particular line of code and then it uh, you'll see that it's connecting and then initializing and you'll see the ram and the disk used uh, which is the uh, python 3 google compute engine backend ram and the uh, disk uh, space used in the backend for running this particular program and then uh, we can uh, hit enter and add another line in the uh, particular um, block or uh, else we can add another line of code here and then we'll just print our version of tensorflow and hit control plus enter yes we can see that tensorflow is uh, successfully working here and the version is 2.2.0 earlier the version was 1.5.2 few months ago and now it's updated automatically so you don't have to update it it's uh, it gets updated automatically you just have to work here uh, many employees in many mncs use your uh, google collabs instead of installing tensorflow in the systems and uh, it's uh, very very efficient so give it a try and see what happens and stay tuned for more such videos and that's it for today's video guys thank you for watching this video i hope you enjoyed so please like this video share with your friends and subs subscribe to the channel